Officials urging everybody to take precautions as the number of mosquitoes testing positive for mosquito-borne illnesses ticks up. Let's take a look at a map here. While the number of counties with human illness still relatively small, there are many counties with mosquitoes, though, testing positive or animals who have turned up infected. Dr. Frank McGeorge with advice on how to avoid being a mosquito magnet. We want to be outside, enjoying every moment of summer that we have left. But if you feel like you tend to get bitten more often than other people, you are probably right. Some people are more attractive to mosquitoes. First, you hear the sound, then feel the bite. Ow! Mosquitoes are active at temperatures above 50 degrees, but they really thrive above 70 degrees. A Harvard study finds type O blood seems to be a mosquito's preferred blood type. They get bit twice as much as people with type A. To reduce your mosquito appeal, avoid wearing red, orange, and dark colors like black or navy. Studies suggest mosquitoes see human skin as a strong red-orange hue, while darker colors are more likely to absorb and retain heat. That heat also attracts mosquitoes. Now, alcohol can also be inviting. One study found drinking 12 ounces of beer attracted mosquitoes to land more frequently on the drinker. Pregnant women also attract about twice as many mosquito bites. They tend to run hot, and they exhale more than 20% more carbon dioxide than women who aren't pregnant. To make your home and yard less inviting, get rid of any standing water. That's where mosquitoes lay their eggs. Empty out kiddie pools, bird baths, garbage cans, and buckets. Insect repellents can help. For safety and effectiveness, the EPA recommends repellents containing DEET, picaridin, permethrin, lemon eucalyptus oil, or lavender to help keep you bite free. Now, mosquitoes tend to be most active between dusk and dawn, so you really want to pay attention and put on bug spray if you or your kids are going to be out then. Mosquito activity in Michigan can sometimes continue all the way to Halloween, so we are definitely not out of the woods yet.